the answer should be no. <laughs> for dress code here at DSA. Dress code colors are black, mm -hmm. white, gold, and khaki. That is correct! Oh, and no hoods. No hoods. Ooh! Another player that wants to enjoy their summer. Next player. I've got these fly crocs that I'm gonna wear. <laughs> oh, I am so sorry, but that is Looks like we'll be seeing player number three in summer school this year. Team Calhoun, it's now your turn. We're the main guidelines for dress code here at DSA. Uh, all shirts must be covered. Ooh, that is correct! No skirts above the knee, no exposed shoulders, and lastly, no ripped jeans. Ooh. Outstanding! Team Calhoun does not want to go to summer school. Now we're moving on to round two. Team C, it's your category. Take your pick. We'll take, we'll take attitude. Attitude? Hmm. And where does a good attitude begin? At the door, with bag check. Make sure all of your bags and pouches are unzipped, even your small bags. Remove all the electronics from the bags and pockets. No liquids are allowed unless it's water in a sealed water bottle. And that's how you start the day, with a great attitude. Steven, <laughs> hey, you're up. What's your category? Uh, we'll take reliability. Because in order to win, you need to be reliable. Right. <coughs> Reliability. I'm so, I don't even know how to read a watch. What time is it? We have a schedule? Um, we would like to ring a win, please. Excellent choice. Ring a win allows Team Win to call in the expert in reliability. Dean Wynn. Dean Wynn, what has changed in the schedule this year and what has stayed the same? This year we have two lunches instead of four. So that way, you have long enough to enjoy your lunch. Good morning. School starts promptly at 8 o'clock. Thank you, Dean Wynn, for saving your team from summer school. Team Calhoun is now your turn. We chose, um, Scala? No, Scoliosis? Wait, no. Scholastic? No, 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 I got it. Scholarship. <laughs> oh, <clears throat> looks like Team Calhoun may need to go to summer school. It's pronounced scholarship. Okay, scholarship. Okay. Okay, scholarship. And what makes a great scholar? We like to call it Calhoun. Yeah. Excellent yeah. choice. Our school counselor, Mr. Calhoun, knows all things about scholarships. Let's call it Calhoun. I guess a good student, you gotta have a good mindset. If you don't have a mindset, you're not gonna do well because you can't go into interactions or you can't go into classrooms thinking, I don't like this teacher. We had a bad attitude. They had a bad attitude last year. Cause sometimes it could be both of y'all. So you gotta go into it with a good mindset. You gotta be organized. And organized also mean like, be consistent, 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 consistent. You can't decide you wanna be an all A student a week before report card. Deal with rejection, especially the 12th grade. Yeah, like we can't change the past, but we can change our future. So set goals. Be realistic with your goals. Attitude, attitude, attitude. No, please do not come down here and see me unless it's a mental health emergency because sometimes I may be with another student and I make you a crazy look because you tell me about Sunday, sometimes y'all forget that it's almost 500 y'all in that Pockets, pockets, something about pockets. Hey Fred, put your phone in the pocket. What phone? This phone. 26. Do you have an answer for us? Look, phones are 
one should definitely not be used during instruction. But if you're not sure, ask the teacher. Oh, thank you, thank you, Team Win. Now we're moving on to Team Calhoun. It's now your category. Next category, we choose thoughtfulness. <laughs> Our teams are tied. Drum roll! 